technically day two, um, but our first full day in the Dominican. We made it here and it is stunning. We are at the sanctuary at Cap Cana in Punta Cana and it is just stunning. I mean, look at that. We really don't have a ton planned. Chris and I just got back from breakfast and after I think we're gonna change and then put on our bathing suits and then go make some of our reservations for the week. At some of the restaurants you have to make a reservation and they also have to book our COVID test um, that we have to take three days before getting back into the United States. So come along. It's just going to be a very relaxing week and I can't stop looking at this view. <laughs> adventure we are on top of the castle right now and we're making our way through the tops of them to try to get to this one view Crazy. I'm, I'm sweating more than Chris, and that is a feat. So, we're gonna go jump in the ocean. mozzarella cheese. Thank you. 
Thursday. It is 1.30, so we've spent the majority of the day at the pool. That's just kind of been our routine is going and get breakfast, laying out by the pool in the morning, grabbing some lunch, and then coming back to the room, hanging out for a little bit, and then heading to the gym. Maybe we'll never leave. I don't know. It's so nice. I look a little crazy. Oh my god. You guys, <laughs> the doors here. I would consider myself to be fairly strong and the doors here are like unfathomably hard to get open and shut. Anyways, I am stepping out and I think the camera is fogging up. Probably fogging up just a little bit. Anyways, um, I'm in the middle of getting ready. The past two nights I really tried hard to beat the sunset and in terms of timing and getting ready and getting back and all the things and I haven't been able to do that and so today I was like Chris we're going to the gym now I'm gonna shower I'm gonna start getting ready you you go do this I'm gonna do this in a relaxed manner more relaxed than how I'm like framing it wow it looks really is it foggy for you guys no nope, that's beautiful all right I don't know maybe it's just maybe it's just my eyes um but I'm in the middle of getting ready because I want to really want to get good sunset pics. We hopefully will have a reservation at the Italian restaurant here on the resort property at 6.30. We have a guaranteed one at 9.30, but they said to check back day of to confirm the 6.30. Y'all, I don't, I don't know the method to the madness with that, um, but we're going with it. So he's going to check that and then he's going to buy a pair of pants so there are two restaurants two or three restaurants here on property that require long pants and closed hood shoes for men and i remember asking chris before we left like hey do you want to grab a pair of long pants he's like no i won't need them and i also didn't think twice about it and i was like yeah no you're you're probably gonna be fine there's a freaking dress code so um <laughs> there's only one option for men's pants and one of the very few stores here on the property and their linen um it, there's just like literally one option so hopefully they fit but chris has like a few like hawaiian shirts and like button-up short sleeve like pattern shirts so ultimately i think it's going to work and be fine in terms of like look the fit might be a little off and it might look a little wonky but i'm gonna finish getting ready and we will get on with our evening after day. Is it good? I like it. <laughs> oh, 
my head because I mean you've got your head massage and then I felt her kind of pulling at my hair just a little bit and I was like I bet you she's braiding my hair Can I try? <laughs> Alright, you know just sells one. Reminds me of a hush puppy. I think this is tartar sauce, so it has to be fish. Have you looked at your fish? Yes. It's looking right at me. <laughs> I think is interesting. Like lunch isn't lunch isn't served until 12:30. Dinner doesn't start until 6:30. It's 6:05 right now, and we are hungry. It's really bad because we're an hour ahead, so it's like.
Thank you. <laughs> From our very messy room. Good morning. Good morning, baby. Come here. You see, the sun is finally starting to get a little bit clearer. What are we about to go do? COVID test. COVID test. It is day six of being here. And today is our last full day, which means we have to go get a COVID test. So, I've never had a PCR test. I've always had the rapid test. Kind of nervous. Just nervous overall. <laughs> I don't know why, because I'm vaccinated, but. <laughs> don't want to be stuck here. I don't want to be stuck. Well, it wouldn't be awful, but I have none of my work stuff, and neither do you. I have, we, I have my laptop, that's about it. So, <laughs> could be worse places to be stuck, but overall that's, the hope is. You have to quarantine in your room, and it's no fun. No well, if fun. you pet test positive, I have to stay here with you regardless, yeah. so. Or if I test positive, so. Fingers crossed, prayers up, we're vaccinated, we've been safe. The staff here has been great. Everyone has been masked. All of the people on the resort too, like even to go into any of the food places, they'll hand you a mask or any indoor space, they'll hand individuals masks. And we've been pretty, I wouldn't say secluded from other people, but Chris and I really haven't mingled. <laughs> we've kept to ourselves. And, um, I, but I think that that's primarily the point of resorts like this is, excuse you, is to just like keep to yourself and enjoy the time together. So. Fingers crossed it all goes well. We have tested negative, we can return home. And now I'm going to sit out here. We both have gotten a little too much sun. Um, Chris in particular wasn't feeling the best for being in the sun. Um, so we just ate lunch and now we're back in our room and I just uploaded our results into Verify. Hopefully those are approved and then we can check in on our flights for tomorrow. In the meantime, I'm going to continue reading. I just started, again, ignore the cold strike. I just started The Vanishing Half by Britt Bennett. It's pretty good. I'm only 25 pages in, but it's pretty good. Going to the steakhouse again. Again. It was. Because it was. Oh, that's right. <laughs> it was very good. Very, very good. We're not going to eat as much, though. We both ate way too much last night. Our last sunset in paradise. Dominican. Oh boy. It's bittersweet. It's 
bittersweet. We have to have one last Nutella crepe. Scrambled eggs, hash brown, bacon, veggies. Side of cafe. The last of the crepes. Last crepe. You said it? Crepes. So good. <laughs> breakfast Chris and I were like might as well go do something and so I'm going to take full advantage of sitting in the sun and looking at the ocean for as long as possible before we have to leave. have been called. Let's say goodbye to our view. Oh, there's a boat. Yes, there's two boats. Two boats. Can you grab that? Uh, Au revoir. Au revoir. Goodbye, beautiful view. Oh, so much. <laughs>